Hello everyone, we are the students of Tripoli at level 3 term 1 of BWEB. This video is about our Tripoli 306 Digital Electronics Lab project. Our project is about lift control system of a 6 storey building. So, here are the members of our group. At first, we have designed our project with Proteas uh, Design Suite 8.1. The project has been successfully submitted by the software. Here is our Proteas. Uh, design file. The design file is divided into two sheets. Uh, here is our parent sheet. Uh, in the parent sheet, the uh, different internal external switch has been shown. Um, uh, this is a uh, uh, internal switch and this is external switches. Uh, we can give a different input uh, now uh, from this section. Um, then uh, we'll go into the child sheet. Uh, there is a uh, four different sections. Um, in the child sheet, we can save uh, for, for different circuit block. The first section is counter block. In the, in the counter block, uh, the, this is an up down counter block. It has also a statue condition feature. Um, here, here is our statue condition uh, which is uh, given into the counter block. And uh, is, this is a up and down call which is uh, given into the counter block. Uh, uh, then the up down and statue are come from the other sections. Then this is uh, our uh, middle section. Uh, it is mainly an input block. Uh, here input uh, call is stored by the JK flip flop. Here is a uh, uh, total 16 uh, uh, JK flip flop. Um, uh, in this uh, JK uh, flip flop, there is also uh, internal clearance sections. Um, mainly input is uh, given into the uh, given into these uh, uh, switches five floor, four floor. Um, three floor uh, there is a, a different input uh, can be given uh, from the internal external position uh, here is a 4 to 16 decoder uh, mainly uh, it, uh, it has uh, it can determine uh, lift position then the uh, left uh, bottom side is uh, uh, external clearing section um, here external clearing function can be uh, can be uh, done by uh, different ex ex external different ex given function. The external uh, here is uh, here we have uh, implement these functions for external clean section. Uh, then the next section is uh, uh, up down section. Uh, the right the right most sections here, here up down and statue uh, uh, features has been implemented the right section is mainly the uh, addition determined sections up down section the addition is decided by this block here is also statue direction is uh, decided this uh, up down and statue function has been uh, decided realized from these functions here uh, um, here uh, up, um, up down is to uh, function that have been realized from these uh, uh, functions the, um, the, I, here you can see the uh, statue uh, condition from which uh, statue uh, uh, condition has been realized uh, and this is a uh, up uh, section and this is uh, down section Uh, now we are going to uh, run the simulation. I am pressing the simulation button. Uh, at first, uh, the lift is in ground floor. Um, now I am pressing uh, fifth down as an external call. Here I am pressing. Uh, I am pressing the call. Now the uh, lift uh, is going in upward position. Uh, here it has reached uh, fifth floor. Now I will give uh, uh, ground floor as a call for fifth floor. Uh, here is uh, the lift is going in downward position. Uh, now I'll give another uh, external input. Uh, two up. Uh, now the lift is going in upward position. Um, 
here it has reached a uh, second floor i will give 5 as a call for second floor now it is going in upper position and it has reached fifth floor uh, now i am to go uh, one down so i am pressing one down button first down so the lift uh, is going in downward position now i am giving a uh, g floor as in call for this floor so we are seeing that uh, our simulation is uh, uh, working successfully so after running the successful software simulation we have enlisted the equipments and proceeded for the hardware section the equipment list and the cost is being shown on the screen we have used many more ICs, VC27 segment decoders, photo 16 decoder, uh, JK flip flops, VC7 um, segment display, breadboard LED, wire adapter, push button switches, and we have also done PCV of four boards costing 3000 taka. And to the total cost of this project is 8690 taka. Here is our hardware project on breadboard, which is simply the hard copy of the software simulation. As we have already seen in Proteus that there are four main blocks, the counter block, external clear block, input block, and up, down, and statute determining block. So in the breadboard, here is the counter block. These two breadboards represent the counter block. And then this is the internal clear or an external clear sections are aligned here and uh, this um, this is the input block and the JK flip flops are there we have placed the JK flip flops uh, for of input blocks here and the J the input blocks uh, the inputs of the JK flip flops are coming from these switches and then we have used uh, 16 push buttons for 10 uh, external switches and 6 internal switches and these are the 10 external switches and they are 5 down, 4 down, 4 down, 3 down and so on and the 4th uh, and the 6th uh, internal switches are there uh, just like the uh, first floor, ground floor, 3rd floor and so on we need clock signal and we have used 555 timer to implement this clock signal of a frequency of 0.6 hertz uh, these two breadboards contains the up, down and statue determining block and the clock signal timer here there are three LEDs indicating the movements of the lift this this rightmost LED will indicate the upward movement this rightmost LED will indicate the upward movement and this middle LED will indicate the statue position of the lift and this leftmost LED will indicate the downward movement of the lift and there are two seven segment display uh, one is for the outside display and the another is for the inside display now we we have used two power adapters to there are two power adapters uh, to uh, supply the to supply power to this whole circuit now we are going to run this project from the bcd display we can see the lift is in ground floor position now i am pressing five down button now we can see that the lift is going upward and the rightmost LED is showing its upward direction. The lift is in now 5th floor position and the middle LED indicating it is remained still in the 5th floor position. Now a call 1F is being made from the 5th floor position. Now we can see the lift is going downward and the leftmost LED is indicating its downward direction. It came to the 1st floor and the middle most LED is indicating it is remains still in the first floor. One of the feature of the lift is when it got two down call from the same direction, it will first take the upper floor call and then the other call. Now I am pressing three down and five down simultaneously. Now we can see that the lift is going upward and going to fifth floor ignoring the third floor call. Now the lift is in fifth floor position and I am pressing one F at the, as the call from fifth floor.
Now the lift is going downward and it stayed in the third floor and the call is made from third floor is one, GF. Now it stayed in the first floor and then it will come to the ground floor as the call from the third floor. Now the case scenario is for two opposite directions. When the lift is going into opposite direction, first it will take the first call and then go for the other call. When the lift is in ground, a up call from the third floor and a down call from the fifth floor has done simultaneously. Now we are seeing the lift is going upward and stayed in the third floor. Then it will take the call from the third floor as 5F. Now the lift is going to the fifth floor. Now the lift is in the fifth floor and a call GF is made from the fifth floor. At the same time, a call 1UP is made from the first floor but the lift ignored that call and came to the ground floor then it will come to the first floor and the call 4f is being made from the first floor so we are seeing that the lift is finally going into the fourth floor the final feature of our lift is if it doesn't get any call for 10 seconds it will automatically go to the ground floor now we will see this So the lift is in ground floor now. So this is all about our breadboard project. Here we have made four PCBs for this project. First uh, board is for counter section. Here we can see its schematic capture and its PCB layout uh, is given in this diagram. And its real PCB we can uh, see from this. Then the second PCB board. Uh, is external clear section and its schematic capture is shown in this diagram and its PCB layout is we can see from this and its uh, real PCB is this uh, then the third PCB is this for uh, up down section and its PCB layout is uh, shown in this diagram and uh, its real PCB uh, uh, here you can see from this the fourth one is uh, FF section uh, uh, here we can see its schematic capture and its PCB layout is shown uh, to the next diagram here we can see its uh, the FF section PCBs and its uh, real PCB is shown in the board unfortunately uh, in the PCB section we are facing problem with the counter section uh, as a result the expected result is not found uh, so we are working on it to uh, re so this is how we have proceeded with our digital electronics lab project thanks for watching